What's good, family? I just want to encourage you on today to let you know that you got this, man. You might be in a hard season right now in your life. You don't know where the provision is going to come from in your life. You don't know how that business is going to thrive in your life. You don't know how you're going to make it and you just got married and things is, is looking bad. You don't know how you're going to make it. But I've got good news for you. With God, all things are possible. He is the God of more than enough. All you have to do is just trust him, walk in his word, walk in his word, confess his word, and do the best that you can in this season to strategize, to plan, to write down. Find you a great coach, a great mentor that can help you through these obstacles and dilemmas that life is throwing at all of us every single day. But you got this, man. You got this. As long as you don't quit, eventually you win. Eventually. And there is no greatness without sacrifice. No sacrifice, no greatness. I learned about God not through seminars only, but through affliction, through trials and tribulation, highs and lows, pros and cons, hardship, hardship. I learned about him. I learned that he loved me, that he wasn't trying to kill me. I wanted me to fail. He was prepping me. He was prepping me, preparing me for greatness. Because if he put you on the mountain of greatness without the preparation through the valleys, it's going to destroy you and kill you because you don't have the unction and the function to thrive on that higher level. It's chaos up there. Everybody think it's just good up there. Yes, it's good, but it's chaos up there. It's all type of problems, all type of situation. So be someone who loves to solve problems, not run from them, embrace them. It's always something to learn in the problem. What an opportunity that you have. An opportunity to learn through adversity and through trial and error. What an opportunity to learn, to learn how to love that wife when it don't seem good. To love those kids when they are not listening and getting on your everlasting nerve. I know I have four myself, two of them that's grown. So that's six total. I know what it's like, but don't quit. It was hard for me. I stayed with God. I stayed in his word. I stayed committed. I was faithful to accountability. And most importantly, I was faithful to me and what God had given me as a strategy for my life in every part of my life, spiritually, physically, financially, socially, emotionally, and mentally. You got this. I said, you got this, man. It ain't going to be easy. It don't supposed to. You a giant. You are triumphant. You are triumphant. You got this, baby. Come on. You got this. Today is your day. Today is your day. Today is your day, family. Can't nothing stop you, man. God loves you. He ain't against you. He's for you. Working in you. Working through you. God is not against you. God is not against you. Circumstance and situation might be, you might not be favorable right now in this time, in this moment, in this season in your life. But trust me, it's serving you well even when you don't know it through affliction. It was good that I was afflicted. Mm. It was good that I was afflicted. It's so much that he's trying to teach you. Just humble yourself. Humble yourself under the mighty hand of God and let God show up and show out in your life when you follow him and his words, his principles, and what he's calling you to do in this moment in time. God bless you, man. This Cornelius Anders music, get at me. And if you haven't found my music, it's all over mainstream digital platforms. Spotify, iTunes, Amazon, Diesel, Apple Music, YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, et cetera, et cetera. Et cetera. It's everywhere. It's going to bless you. 26 Amazing Apple, man. Go get it. It's going to bless you and your wife and your family. I'm talking about things in, in life that people are not talking about in music. And I'm just being real and being raw and giving you exactly what God has given me through life experiences. Through life experience, not something I just made up, but life taught me the highs and the lows. How to function and thrive through chaos, through adversity. It was hell, but I made it through. So can you. Get at me. It'll bless you. Peace.